today, Sutishil Lebedev, in a time of 51, 15, 37, 47, finished the Sri Chinmoy 3100 mile race for the 10th time. I dreamt about this finish for seven years. My last successful finish in the it was 2015. Then 2016 I didn't finish. Then 2017 I swam Zurich Lake. Then I was stuck in Ukraine for several years, cannot participate. And then I prayed for Guru to allow me to run the race. And he did a miracle, I received a visa, and last year I ran the race, but I didn't finish. So this year I was smarter, I modified my prayer, <laughs> <laughs> and it worked. Day five, I was feeling quite bad and like with all symptoms of COVID. So I um, uh, escaped, like I, I went home early, quite early. And then next morning, Rupantor uh, drove me to a PCR test. And I heard from him the funniest joke this year, definitely. Because uh, you remember, Kobe dropped off, and then uh, uh, Nirvasha was sick, and then like I was kind of suspended. And Rupanov said, "Oh, you know, we accepted so many applications just for somebody to finish." <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, luckily I was uh, negative on the test, but I lost like 12 hours of uh, running, and it's easily 40 miles, easily. But then, during this week, when I came back, next morning, next to actually lunch, somehow mm, I received a message from Guru that you will easily cover the gap. And it happened, like in seven or ten days. But then, <laughs> it's not the end. Then next week, I received another message. You will not only finish, but you will do your personal best. And I, it was so inspiring. Somehow, um, I, I think some forces intervened, and I, I uh, received this shin splint uh, for some reasons. Well, ultimately all for good reasons. But I lost like three days. Anyway, I was able to finish. I'm just on the seventh sky to offer every step, every press, every heartbeat for you, for uh, author of everything. And like I said, there is only one force, and he is this one force. And without this force, we just cannot do anything. anything. So I'm very, very happy to finally fulfill my dream, like really seven years, it's a long time. But it's also inspiring, I must say inspiring, because I finished injury-free and even, I would say, pain-free. And I can see that now my body and performance is much more consistent and stable than 18 years ago when I entered the 100 mile project. So there is a hope. There is a hope. <laughs> and yeah, for instance, uh, Madhupran did the world record with the age 54, and 
for us, it did the world record at the age 56. So there are still more, <laughs> more years. Yeah, I, I cannot express enough my gratitude to everybody who has supported my dream to finish. And yeah, many individuals, uh, Enthusiasm Awakening is just an amazing, authentic part installed by Guru of this race. And I'm very, very, very happy and very grateful for Enthusiasm Awakening for every, every single morning. It's <laughs> no job. <laughs> But um, I think uh, I did 51 job. <laughs> yeah, so I probably I need uh, to have a contest <laughs> for a best job. Then <laughs> yeah, uh, yeah, I need to thank my family for uh, support for. Uh, it's always, always like uh, not only running but learning many, many dimensions, many things. Always something new to be a better person. Like one, one aphorism written by Guru in 2007 just touched my heart. Be good and remain good if you want to be a God's chosen child. So be good, yeah. It's for me. <laughs> uh, I must thank, I want to thank one particular person specifically because he was really instrumental of pulling me out from Ukraine and helping in every possible way for me to start the race and to finish the race. We can Thank you. 